Liberty stands for Lithium Breeding Tritium Innovation and the program as it's scoped at the moment is a four-year program. Fusion, when you talk about it as a science, has been a very exciting place in which to play for the last 50 years or more. And we've worked with machines, Tokamak Stellarators, to confine plasmas to develop an energy source, which is neutrons with heat and kinetic energy. As we go forward and we start to work towards fusion power plants, we have to imagine the balance of plant and things like a fuel cycle. And as we go into that power plant regime in the future, it is industry that needs to be empowered. So we want industry to have materials, components and integrated systems of engineering that are functional. And so Liberty is hoping to scale up the science work that's been done in many labs around the world and allow industry to bring prototype integrated engineering pieces and demonstrate tritium breeding on those engineered pieces so that we move from a science experiment and progression of science knowledge to a sense of confidence in the supply chain that they are capable of producing future power plants. At its core, Liberty is hoping to deliver a test bed that is a physical reality, a building in which we have a neutron source and space to assemble and disassemble experiments. But Liberty is also hoping to deliver something digital in silico replication of the physical experiment and the multi-physics models of tritium breeding in such a way that we produce a real enablement for industry towards the qualification of breeders being able to play into a digital replica an idea of an engineered breeder, test it on the experiment, and then see if the outcomes match the original model. is a very powerful way of being able to design future breeders in industry. And so the minimum for Liberty would be the building, the source, the space in which to play, and the digital platform.